Ross has been very busy since I last saw him. He has uh, gotten a couple layers added on, as well as done some detailing, although not terribly much, just because, you know, it's that's going to be a job in and of itself. <laughs> This is not the permanent outside, I just, I need to make that abundantly clear. Yeah, there was a, I actually did see him once since last time we were on. He added this window and another floor which we had to actually move up a bit because he didn't leave any space for redstone accidentally, which, you know, yeah. that's, <laughs> that's fair. It was late, I, I, I just went, I was excited, I wanted yeah. to make the place taller. Hell yeah. yeah. I was excited when I saw what you had built, but I was like, wait a minute. Darn, there's no spot for redstone. <laughs> but now they're- oh, right, I forgot to show you. Okay, so. Uh, just do this. And once you're in, take off your Elytra so they don't lose their ability, because they totally will. Mm -hmm. Alright, so right under the bedroom, there is just one block of redstone area. Mm -hmm. But under the tower, it's black. Cool. Alright, so coming through from this area we were just in, there is the king's chamber, and then over here is where the main, like the, the tallest tower is going to be. We're thinking, uh, or at least Ross is thinking, a library down here. I was thinking about putting some uh, auto crafting, or not auto crafting, but uh, like hidden crafting stuff in the floor. Up at the very top here we don't have anything yet, but if we go back down to where we were a second ago, Ross has done some amazing work with the battlements. From here, there are two ways to get to the battlements, I think. One door here, which leads out here. Got this great pattern on them. And there's the other door that leads out here. And it just goes all the way around. At some point, there's, I think, a stairway to get up to the next level. He did do some battlements on the next level. Is there a way up there, Ross? No, not yet. Okay, I guess I'll just have to fly them. Okay, so up here, got some some more of this, the same sort of battlements, although he didn't use quite as much cobblestone, I noticed. Looks really nice, though. Yeah. Also working on a uh, little thing over at the pillager outpost nearby. I have made a collection system as well as a tunnel that leads all the way over to, well, currently right here, that uh, can transport the pillagers once I get some water in place. Although I keep coming down here to mine it out without, a, without torches, so <laughs> I keep having to stop. There was a thunderstorm a little while back while I was over by the hyper smelter and I got a skeleton head, a zombie head, and a record, so that's cool. Here is what I've dug out at the Pillager Outpost. I really need to collect this chest and stuff. I'm really tempted to just dig it out and let them all fall, because that would be funny. <laughs> I'm going to do that real quick. Here they come. Uh-oh. Oh boy. What have I gotten myself into? Oh boy, get me out of here! Get me out of here! Ugh. Oh boy. What are you doing? Um, <laughs> pillager fun. <laughs> but like 32 of them just walked down into this hole that I dug. You know, I mean, I feel sorry for you. I really enjoyed it. But there's something to be said about poking a bear. There's also something to be said about poking 32 bears. <laughs> Holy shit, there's a lot of them. And I'm lagging. <laughs> there's just this hole that's full of them. Man, they have really besieged their own tower here. Shit, I can't go to a window without being shot. They must be good at what they do. 
Well, there's a reason that I don't like raids. <laughs> oh, shit. I, uh, didn't realize I had this many potions just on me. Fire resistance, swiftness, weakness. Oh, shit. Oh. Um, light vision, visibility. Uh, I didn't even think about that one. Water Invisibility. <laughs> yeah. Don't worry, man. You're never gonna see me using it. Oh. <laughs> I hear hijinks. Hmm? What do you mean? Oh fuck, I didn't close off the other side of the hole. They're all being funneled into a stairway that leads up outside of the castle. That's something that I should probably have... Oh no, I can hear them all. They've gotten down the tunnel. They can block off the exit. <laughs> okay, I came back. <laughs> I went over to the hole where they would be coming out and got to the stairs. And right when I got to the stairs, like five of them rounded the corner and started climbing. <laughs> Ooh, that gate area at the front. Um, the door is too small for an iron, iron golem to fit. We could put an iron golem in that annex. Even though I was spamming the punch button to send it back at him. Like, it, it, it oh my god. That would be a lag. No luck whatsoever in anything. Okay, so something about this realm is just cursed. <laughs> Every time Ross and I come over here, our pain drops a lot. We have no idea why. I've put a disposal system in that'll get rid of the, will get rid of the pillagers, and they just, I, I don't know, they just start, the lag just kills us every time we come here. A chance? I think there's a chance to do some more building. Cool. Nope, maybe not. Seriously. Mojang, how many of these guys are supposed to spawn here? <laughs> I mean, really? <sighs> Don't you dare hit me into there, that's certain death. Can't get any work done on this thing because of them. Alright, so it looks like I've got two more sides left to do. Holy shit! <laughs> There's so many of them. But me flying around like this isn't helping too much because it's making them all want to spawn in this area. Oh boy. It's gonna be a really good farm once it's done though. <laughs> now that, that is a beautiful sight. <laughs> the clogging up the exit hole. On, guys, one at a time. You can all die peacefully in lava. It'll be fine. <laughs> Man, I can't believe I didn't use bows before now. This is great. In one shot basically anything. Why did I not try this sooner? Like, really? Alright. Uh, that debacle is over. I'm gonna see if I can get this uh, secret passage hooked up. Shouldn't be too terribly difficult. Fingers crossed. Well, it occurs to me that we do not actually have any quartz here. So I'm gonna have to go on a quick mining session to get some. Alright, observers in hand. Let's go ahead and see if we can finish this up. I think this should be easy enough to put together because all I have to do is have a single, ex a single piston and a double piston extender. Bros may um There's something very wrong with Ross's connection. Um I keep spawning in in midair. Oh wait, what level are you? Uh you're you're on the bath, bath level. Oh okay, gotcha. Man? Hey! Hey! Thank you, sir. It kept kicking me for flight god damn. You got If you will accompany me to the throne room. Yes, sir. 
Oh, damn. All right. Somewhere in this room is a redstone trigger that opens the secret passage we made behind the behind the uh, uh -huh. thing. X. Well, that was fast. Well, there are only so many places to hide things. Oh, is it on the timer? Yeah. Wait, then how do we get back out once it's closed? There's a button down here. Oh, cool. Just push the button and... Oh, uh, that's... Epic. Suffocate me. Remember... Oh, hey. I see you got the bathroom reinstalled. And the fancy floor is back as well. Oh, you know what? What, what? It would be cool to make that really big piston door that I designed down in the prairie by the village. Right, we should work on the towers next. I'm thinking maybe come out one more block. But like just a flat block as opposed oh, yeah. to as opposed to stairs. You know what? I'm gonna try it in the creative world. <laughs> well that's a lot of squid. Ink time. For those of you wondering what happened to Chester, our little cat over by the hyper smelter, I just transported him here to the castle. Okay, so Cosmo here hasn't seen the area that we're working on yet. Wait, should we, should we do a skin reveal? For for you? For us. Oh, I already did mine. I've been on uh, uh, quite a bit over the past couple days with Ross. Uh, new, new skin. Oh my god, dude. Hm. I just saw your statue. What the hell? Yeah, it's it's really bad. <laughs> is that a sword and an axe? Yeah, Why I was, I'm kind of okay. I don't know. I had it in my inventory and I was trying to get it out. <laughs> I'm kind of happy with how the axe came out, but the other part I don't like. Business with it, amazing. Yeah. Well, we're not sure if it's blood stains or if it's just like rip, rips and tears in like my suit. But. And if it is blood stains, is it his or the people that didn't pay their loans? Withers don't have. <laughs> Ignore the stage. Yeah, it's it's bad. It's really bad. Although I am kind of happy with the axe. So is it just wearing pants? Like it needs like... to be smaller, but uh, I don't know. I just the threw axe, together whatever stuff was in my. Yeah, yeah, definitely needs to be smaller, but I think it's okay. Right. I just threw I it together with whatever blocks I had. Like the... Hey, right, Cosmo. The reveal of the main room. Oh wow. Should should, cool. should we show him the way to the dungeon? Ooh. Uh, Let's see if he can figure it out. All right. Oh, wait, dungeon. Yeah, I set up a what? stairway. I set up a stairway in there. Yeah. It goes way down. Okay. What's yeah. The, what is? Wait. Do I need to? Do I need to break anything? No, you do not. Of course. The oh, first thing to try. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, oh, do you have? Food. Do you have any raw food? Which do you have any raw? I like have, a potato I have or? Raw okay. Raw th raw throw it on there. Throw them on the magma block. Oh my god, that's so cool. It, it, it takes a minute. Oh my god, that's so cool. Someone just stole it. Ross no. just stole it. Big fur. Hey, uh, get your elytra on. Oh yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> yeah forgot. Don't take off before he has them on. What? Oh, no, 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 no! Ah! <laughs> messing me up! Okay, okay. Uh, I don't even know where you fell. Okay, so, uh, Cosmo. Uh, yes. Uh, Captain. More stuff to see. Okay, where are you? Uh, I'm up by the castle. Wait, is there more stuff around the thing? Yeah, there's the pillager and the area where he's gonna be building and the mine. Oh, oh alright. Right. I don't know uh, what he's gonna be building, but you should where are you? Oh, there you are. On whatever's here. Where did the? I, I lost. I, I know. I don't have all my stuff back, but okay. All right. Oh, sorry. Behind you. Cosmo. Cosmo. Behind you. I, I was going to. I was going to the castle. Yeah, but I landed in front of you, and you just walked past me. Oh. I didn't see you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 
Okay, okay. Yeah, it's a good thing I had you set your spawn, huh? <laughs> yeah. Thanks. Right over here. Do My not, God. do not fall in the water at the base. You will probably die, and lose all of your stuff because there's lava. Uh, 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 no, 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 no. <laughs> Cosmo burned in lava. Technical <laughs> difficulty. I am not. Uh, it's not letting me. Okay, so I'm, I'm slowing down. Slowing down. Dude, angle oh. up higher than you expect to have to go. There okay. you go. I imagine this is what Superman was like when he first like had started to fly. Right now they just fall into lava. But uh, where'd you go? Okay. So if right here. if you follow me, a there isn't one currently. No, no. Okay. There we go. Okay. Come on. Lag. Okay. Cool. My goodness, that's a lot of lag. Yep. Uh, boy. I forgot I wasn't wearing diamond. Death counter on three. <laughs> Actually, I'm on my way. King of the death counter. Yo, you want me to die again? I will. Oh shit, I almost just shot you, man. <laughs> I was try I'm trying to die, didn't you just hear me? Do be this. Butthead? Uh, no, no, he's butthead. You're... Is that third one of these, butthead? Cool. Oh. No, dude, the show is called Beavis and Butthead. Don't they have other characters? Is what I'm saying. Uh, you could be Beavis and Butthead and Philip. <laughs> okay, okay, so. I have a so friend I'm named Philip. Beavis, Butthead, Philip, you're Philip. I kind of want to just punch you off the edge right now because I think it would be no. funny. Strike me down and I shall only become more powerful than you can ever imagine. <laughs> that was a hundred percent your fault, man. It was, I forgot about the thorns. That was fucking amazing. Beavis, butthead, and... Boobies. You're Daria. So there's a pillager... Uh... Party... Down at the base. So, let them be. We'll make things interesting. We'll have a force outside of the castle. <laughs> I know. I'll lead them up and have them lead us to to Cosmo. Exactly. Yeah, that'll totally work. Totally. Come on, buddy. Hey, we should pacify this one. Just lock him inside somewhere. Yeah, we should pacify them all. Pacify what? This pillager. Dude, that's how we get prisoners, man. Oh, pill okay. How do you pass by a pillager? Uh, you have them use up their crossbow durability. Oh, okay. You just tank damage or have somewhere that they can see you but not hit you. Lock him in place and... That's a good idea. Can you lock him in place? I'll just keep standing here. Well, it looks like I forgot to record an outro again. Sorry about that. In its place, please enjoy these four time lapses. The first one is a record farm that I built pretty quickly and got, I think, five or six different unique discs from. I got a lot more than that, but that many unique ones. Then the second one is me building up the creeper farm that I built a little ways to the west of my island. And the last two are me killing my first wither in survival, actually, and using the beacon that I get from it to make the base a little bit bigger.
So once again, sorry for forgetting to record an outro again. It's starting to become a bit of a pattern. But if you guys enjoyed the video, maybe leave a like. If you didn't, don't like it, dislike, I don't really care. And if you really enjoyed, maybe consider subscribing so you can get notified when we make new content. Thank you all for watching, and have a wonderful rest of your day. Thank you.